Yeah, have you ever listened to Laura Ingram on the radio? Yes, I have. You have? Have you seen her fill in when uh, she's on filling in for Bill Riley on Fox News? And I got to admit, and I'm going to tell you, I do watch Bill Riley sometimes, but when she's the host, that television goes click, click, click off. Okay, well, what do you think of her? Um, not much. You know, I wouldn't listen to her. Uh, she doesn't uh, blow wind in my chest. Well, once again, this is another individual who I guess she's trying to be the female Rush Limbaugh. Because what she does is she just throws things against the wall. I mean, anything that's anti-democratic, uh, she's there. Uh, but one thing disturbed me recently when I accidentally listened to her show on the radio, uh, just to kind of compare notes. But anyway, it is amazing how she started. She started attacking, and I think this is kind of like off-limits, she started attacking President Obama's wife. I mean, it's one thing to attack the Democratic Party and the president, but I think when you go after his wife, don't you think that's a little little over the edge? Yeah, but what was uh, the reasoning behind it? Well, just about her making a, a appearances on TV shows, uh, being gun ho about some of the belief, some of her charitable beliefs, and, and she just kind of like went off and saying, "Well, now that she's out here and she's voicing her opinions, all of a sudden she's open game for people like me in the media to attack." Yeah, I, I agree with you. I don't see it. Uh, the president's wife actually has been very low profile. I don't think she's done anything out of the ordinary to uh, cause people to, uh, you know, be up in arms about what she said. So uh, uh, it's kind of like, why bother? I mean, she's not a real issue. Oh, okay. But this, this is what I say to Laura Ingram. Shut up. And the reason why I say that is because when Sarah Palin was out there, oh, you could not say a thing about her husband. But Sarah Palin, Palin had her husband, and especially her kids. I mean, just parade them all over the place, have them do TV shows, appearing on Dancing with the Stars. But if any individual said anything about Sarah Palin's spouse and her kids who were being jammed down her throat, Laura Ingram was the biggest defender saying you're off limits. It's all about Sarah Palin and not her family and not her spouse. But yet she was throwing those things, throwing, I'm sorry, throwing her family down our throat with appearances all over the place, doing interviews, bringing her family. What do you think of that? Yeah, take some time and that. Uh, I, I think, you know, it's right-wing uh, propaganda. That's all she's about. Yeah, I mean, how hypocritical is that? See, that's the thing. That's where some of these individuals who at times are, are pretty knowledgeable, they lose their credibility. And that's why millions are now tuning in to the Stone and Digital Day Show. That's the reason why. We give it to you always. You're not getting it from the left, the right, the middle. We're giving our opinions and we don't care where they're coming from. Well, we care where they're coming from, but they're coming up the middle. Right, exactly, okay. They're coming up the middle, simple as that.